Japan has just built a train that can travel over 300 miles per hour. That is right, folks. Check this out. The fastest train right now in the United States is the Acela Express. It goes up and down the east coast of the country. It travels between Washington, D.C. and Boston, and it reaches speeds of about 150 miles per hour. Now, if you've been on it, you know that it's not actually traveling 150 miles an hour the whole time, but that's the top speed. Now, meanwhile, trains are a lot faster elsewhere in the world, especially in Europe and Asia. One of the fastest commercial trains in the world is called the Shanghai Maglev train, which travels up to 268 miles per hour. But now Japan is looking to surpass China with their new train that can go more than 310 miles per hour. Passengers got an opportunity to try it out this week. Now, What's being tested this week is the first section of a longer route that's slated to be finished by 2027. The Daily Mail is reporting that when it's completed in 2027, the exceptional speed capacity will cut travel time by half, linking Tokyo's Shinagua Station with Nagoya in about 40 minutes, a journey that usually takes approximately 80 minutes. So this is a big deal. We've seen Asia and Europe um, Eastern Europe especially, really investing in these high-speed train systems. Meanwhile, in the United States, uh, I mean, all things considered, our transportation infrastructure is kind of a mess. So what would this look like if we were eventually able to bring this technology to the United States? Amtrak released a proposal in 2010 that could allow trains to carry passengers from D.C. to New York in as little as 96 minutes. But here is the depressing thing about America. One, it would cost $117 billion, and two, if they started right now, the project wouldn't be finished until 2040. So, America, we need to step our game up. Big shout out to the 310 mile per hour train going in in Japan. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe.